Hi, pharmacist Benjamin I. Fuchs here to talk about the difference between retinol and hydroquinone when it comes to hyperpigmentation. Hyperpigmentation is a troublesome and costly skin condition that affects millions of Americans and is a source of consternation and concern for those of us who want beautiful, youthful skin. If you go to a doctor for your discolored skin, you're going to get a cream or lotion that contains a prescription drug called hydroquinone, which is considered to be the gold standard ingredient for lightening the skin. Typical products have 4%. When I was in my pharmacy, I used to formulate prescriptions that contained up to 15, even up to 20% hydroquinone. While effective, hydroquinone containing products have a couple of issues associated with them that can make them difficult to use. For one thing, hydroquinone is toxic. If you were to ingest hydroquinone, you would get pretty sick. It could even be fatal. And while it's not supposed to be eaten, do you really want to rub a chemical on your skin that is so poisonous that could kill you if you were to eat it? Hydroquinone is also unstable. It breaks down products that contain it, and it itself breaks down in the presence of moisture. Hydroquinone is also toxic to pigment cells, and overuse can lead to hypopigmentation, or permanent white spots. On the other hand, there's an effective skin lightener that works just as well as hydroquinone. It's called retinol, also known as pre-vitamin A. And unlike hydroquinone, retinol is a nutritional molecule that is not only non-toxic, but it's actually good for you and your skin. Instead of killing skin cells like hydroquinone, retinol is healthy for your skin cells. It reverses wrinkles and fine lines by turning on collagen and hyaluronic acid production. It stimulates cell division and stabilizes cell growth. Retinol exfoliates, it smooths the skin, and it can improve blemish formation or prevent dark spots that can occur after you get a pimple. And retinol is way more stable than hydroquinone. If you really want to take advantage of retinol for skin lightening, look for high concentrations. I recommend anywhere from 1% to 2%, up to 5% strengths, and retinol works especially well for skin lightening when it's combined with fatty vitamin C, as in my Truth Retinol 1% gel, my Truth Retinol 5% gel, and our Truth Retinol spot treatment. Healthy skin is beautiful skin. I'm pharmacist Benjamin I. Fuchs. I know you are going to love the truth.